From the newsroom at news.com.au. Hi, I'm Nanny Young and this is the latest from the newsroom. It's Friday the 18th of March. Senior Labor MP Penny Wong has revealed she had apologised to the late Senator Kimberly Kitching for a hurtful jibe during a meeting in 2019. Senators Wong, Keneally and Gallagher, who Senator Kitching reportedly referred to as the Mean Girls, have rejected bullying accusations in a joint statement. Senator Kitching's sudden death last week has been prompting anger from all sides about the way she was treated by her party and her colleagues. To New South Wales now, where the man police allege murdered Charlize Mutton, the nine-year-old whose body was found in a barrel in January, has been hit with a fresh charge. During a court appearance on Friday, prosecutors revealed the 31-year-old had recently been charged with breaching his parole, which he was serving after a 2016 drug supply conviction as a result of his murder charge. To the UK now, the BBC says it's paid a substantial sum and apologised to Princess Diana's former private secretary, Patrick Jeffson, over the infamous 1995 interview. An independent report last year found that BBC interviewer Martin Bashir had tricked Diana's brother into helping him arrange the interview, in which she spoke candidly about her troubled marriage to Prince Charles. Well, there were three of us in this marriage, so it was a bit crowded. (laughs) Now to sport, Fox Sports journalist Tom Morris has been stood down after a recording of him making misogynistic comments about a female colleague was leaked online. The development came as Western Bulldogs coach Luke Beveridge apologised to Morris after an outburst in a press conference in the wake of Wednesday night's loss to Melbourne. I want to apologise for my behaviour. I want to apologise to Tom Morris and all those present last night, including other members of the media. To entertainment now, thousands are petitioning for a Marilyn Manson music video to be stripped from YouTube after actress Evan Rachel Wood claimed he raped her during filming. The Westworld actress, now 34, starred in the 2007 video for Heart-Shaped Glasses alongside Manson, in which the pair are seen simulating sex. She revealed her claims in her shocking new tell-all documentary, Phoenix Rising, which streams now on Binge. That's the latest from the newsroom. We'll be back soon with another update. Get the latest from news.com.au.